All right, what's going on? So I'm gonna try to put up some videos like this, you know, off the cuff type of videos, you know. A um, Couple of things came up this morning. By the way, happy Monday to you. Uh, I have never have to wake up on a Monday morning and go anywhere ever in my life. <laughs> okay, maybe, maybe in the last, uh, maybe before 2006 something like that sorry about that i covered my hand maybe, maybe before that oh yeah i forgot my coffee i was coming upstairs to warm my coffee but right now it's about uh let me look at the time really quickly it's about well it's 10 after 10 a.m in the morning monday morning shout out to you if you're watching me right now congratulations to you by the way, don't forget, if you're brand new here, go to smartrealestatewholesaling.com. And also make sure you go to 11dayschallenge.com. Let's get started. Let's not waste any more time. Like I was saying, I've never had to wake up in the morning uh, since 2006, basically, when I quit my FedEx job. You can see my story, my complete story, when you go to 11dayschallenge.com. You can see a short story of how I got here. But since 2006, we're in 2021 right now. I've never had to wake up and go anywhere on a Monday morning, okay? <laughs> I have some, um, we have some digital marketing stuff going on. So I came here to warm up my coffee. Just so um, it got cold a little bit. So basically, I've never had to wake up and go anywhere Oh no, on the Monday morning, at least not a job, right? Uh, this morning I had to drop my baby off, of course, in school. He's, they're doing half day right now because of the pandemics and stuff. They go to school two days in a week. So, but basically, the reason why I came here to talk to you this morning, there are two tips I want to share with you. I'm going to try to drop tips like this from time to time on this, uh, on this, uh, on our video channels, okay? Uh, the idea is very simple. Okay, deals and leads. So I was just watching, a, you know, when you watch some of these videos on YouTube and you see some of these ads comes up with all these tools. Everyone is creating tools these days, right? And they go, yeah, you know, they pull up this map, right? They pull up this map and they say, hey, that's a deal right there. There's a bunch of deals and they show all this red. You know, you probably watched another video today to see that ad, you know, and they say, these are deals, these are deals in all these different places in, in the county. And, uh, and then, wow, it dawned on me, like, this is why people are confused when they use terminologies like that. Excuse me. Sorry, the noise is the microwave, by the way. When they use terminologies like that, right, they, they say they call basically just houses deals. Uh, well, those terminologies like that, obviously anyone gets to use any words the way they want. That's fine, you know. But let me just tell you like this. If that's how you think of deals, there's a good chance that you will get frustrated out of the business way too soon. Does that make sense? So if there's supposed to be deals and you're not making money and you've collected 2,000 of them, 3,000, and you're not making any money after you've paid, I don't know, about $3,000 for the for the software for a while, over, I mean, over months, it adds up, right? And then you find out that, okay, there's no deals right because there's no because it wasn't deals in the first place those that's just data right so there's this thing we call the five stages if you're looking to wholesale or invest in real estate there is the five stages that's what it comes down to there is data there is contact right uh this is basically when you you know when you find ways to contact uh the 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 owners of the property behind the scene right and then you generate leads, right? Leads, right? Leads mean somebody who has who has shown an interest that they're looking to sell a property and they're open to a conversation with you. Uh, we also call that motivated seller leads. I want to talk about motivation here in a second. My brother Brian Irigbu, I think that's how he pronounce his name. I'm not sure Irigbu uh, is one of the gurus in this uh, in the in the business. Uh, I, I was just watching him with a TTP. TTP um, Brent Daniels talking about motivation. I'm going to talk about that in a second as well. And uh, 
Oh, by the way, we're talking about real estate wholesaling. If you're brand here, you don't know what we're talking about. Real estate wholesaling is basically a strategy that allows us to flip contracts on properties, sales contracts, purchase contracts, basically flip houses, okay, for ten, fifteen, twenty-five thousand dollars. That's what we're talking about. All right, so you have leads, okay? So I mean you can find all of this when you go through 11 days challenge. You can find it in details. You know, let me go back from the beginning. You have data. You have contact, you have leads, and then you have contract. You lock the property under up under contract once you agree, right? And then, then you can potentially close a deal. But most people talk about deals all the way from the beginning, which is data, right? So from data to deals, you see there's a series here that we're kind of uh, going to hire us right now. Uh, from data to deals, right? But you can't jump to deals unless you've gone through that five stage, five steps process. That's something we'll cover uh, in details, in very simple ways, in 11 dayschallengecom But here's the point I'm trying to make here. The point I'm trying to make is very simple. Um, when when you generate data, some people call it deals because they're trying to sell you a software, right? No, they're not deals until they close, right? Um, by the way, look out for a program we have coming up where you'll be able to make money with or without closing deals. Okay, you can make a thousand dollars per day with or without closing deals. So make sure you subscribe to this channel if you want to be notified when that happens. Right? Or follow us. Or make sure you go to the website and drop into the newsletter. Go download the book SmartRealEstateWholesaling.com. But yeah, let's talk about motivation for a second. What is motivated seller? I was just listening to my brother Brian talk about it's not. They're not necessarily not motivated if they're not looking to sell, sell pennies and dollars. That's true, okay? But let me just say this. Motivation is a requirement. If they're not motivated, there's no need to have further conversations. What does motivation, what does a motivated seller look like? They're looking for a solution. They may not be in a position to sell the property at a penny on a dollar. That's very, very true. However, don't continue conversation of try to force yourself down people's throat if they're not open to a conversation. If they hung up the phone on you, right, there's no need to try to continue conversation with a person or try to beg them to sell. That usually means that you don't have a lead pipeline, right? That's usually what that means. You want to make sure you have a lead pipeline. You want to make sure that you have a lead pipeline. You need to make sure that, what is the pipeline from data to deals? There's, it's a funnel, it's a sales funnel. For those of you that are in digital marketing, you should know what that means. If you don't know what that means, even if you're a wholesaler, you're probably gonna fail in this marketplace because saturation, you know, at that level where you are, the market is saturated, but the market is not saturated ultimately. Um, but if you are mediocre, yeah, of course, the market is saturated. Everyone is cold calling. Everyone is driving for dollars. If you're operating at that level, the market is absolutely saturated. But the market is really never saturated. It just means you're operating at a mediocre level. That's why I created 11 dayschallengecom and I made it extremely affordable, meaning you can get started for less than the price of your lunch at work. All right. So with that being said, so motivation is a requirement. Uh, please don't misconstrue what he said for, hey, I should just beg everybody to do a deal with me. There's creative finance, there's this. No, what it means is that you should approach with a problem-solving mindset, okay? You have a motivated seller, meaning somebody that have been trying to sell a property, but they couldn't get rid of it. They called you. That means they need you. So you need to fact-find, put your desire to want to close a deal on the side for a second, and then just, just be open to solving a problem. And, okay... So are you looking, what are you looking for? To find out what they're looking for. If they're looking to save time, then you could probably get the house for a penny on a dollar. If they're looking for just to get rid of the property, but they can't afford because the bank, they hold too much at the bank, then you still need to come up with other creative ways to solve that problem for them. And that's your job and that's how you get paid. And you get paid over and over. And they're gonna refer more. If you help them, they're gonna refer enough people to you over time 
and but the idea is to create a pipeline okay just right now i have an email in front of me of somebody that we try to do a deal with literally like seven months ago they are reaching back out and they are ready to let go of the house the house that's worth three hundred thousand dollars for seventy thousand dollars that's how it works you need a lead pipeline you need to feed the lead pipeline uh, you're looking to get rich quick this is still the get rich quick platform however let's put that in context there's work requirement required there's investment required that's all i have i will try to come up and drop in videos like this all the time just go to smart I i'm probably go to smart real estate wholesaling.com go to but just go in the links in the description box and you see all the links you need i'll see you at the top see you on the next video bye now to learn more about real estate wholesaling and investing, please visit www.smartrealestatewholesaling.com and for our quick start program, go to www.11dayschallenge.com.